All right, so we're going to uh, try and replicate what we have here. And um, the way we're going to do it is we're going to start with um, this. We'll get back here. Under the Jumbotron, we'll start with a basic div. And um, the div, that's just it. Then we're going to have another div that we're going to call container. Container. So this container will have a div called row with a class of row. Class row. And then each row will have several columns. So we we'll have a div with a class of row. That will be three columns. So um, what I'm trying to do is the, the first div will cover the X stream. The second row will be the container that will contain these three guys. Then these three guys will be divided equally among themselves. So let's do a fresh content. So um, we could do a H, I don't know, H3. Let's look at what it is first. Paste what we have. H3, H3. Then we'll do a P. And copy the name. The P says choose. So we have an H3 and P. Let's see what it looks like first before we we proceed. Um, we have this reload. So we have that fresh content okay makes sense so let's copy the remaining trusted instructors pick courses right whatever so um i think basically we should duplicate this but before we we go ahead let me show you that there's something um we are not looking at yet there is this look at where this logo is look at where this logo is look at where this logo is or um, icon look at where they are so we need to arrange this content to take note of the icon so this is under media in bootstrap so if we go to bootstrap and um, we look for media uh, just type media media object or media list so this is what it looks like there is an, an image or icon here there is a heading then there's a body that's what it looks like isn't that so I think we should just use this straight up instead of um, trying to improvise so if you read through media see media is on the layout if you read through media you'll see different kinds of arrangements look at this one in the middle look at this one at the bottom so you see different kind of media arrangements this is a media list media list on style so it all makes sense so in our own case we might just call it a media list let's say i'm importing it here media and um, of course we'll, we'll work on the image we'll change the image to an icon but it now gives us the, the structure we need so if i copy the fresh content and um, here then i copy the rest of what they have here and um, this is the list is cool then we can then use it here so this makes sense we paste good i think we're generally good let's test and see um, that our design is good all right um, we can't scroll beyond it but if you look here you can see now we have an issue with the image now we're going to have to go and get an, an icon for that in our case we're looking at, at an icon that looks like a play button of course their designer is the one that created this icon by himself but we're gonna just go to point of someone hijack any icon that looks remotely like that okay so we're gonna it looks like a play button play, play. Um, something like this something like this um, if you scroll down and take your time you could find something very close to that so, but in this case, I'm going to use play cycle. Click on it once. 
and then they show you what it is you click on this it copies so we're here instead of the image we will margin right three so we need to be careful what we're doing plus we can do mr3 add mr3 to the class all right and we're good this makes sense and uh, we can go check it out let's see what our design looks like now keep your eye here the load page all right so as you can see it's not here but it's too tiny from what we have here it's huge here almost the size of both of them but here it's too tiny so um we have to work on that we expand the size the idea is that if we get one correctly the rest won't be tall so we can add a style here and say oh uh, let's say display display um five or display yeah display five that's how bootstrap helps you to expand text we can refresh i'm surprised it's not expanding and one funky reason is that the um we need to actually put it on four a lower display for it to work so if we put it on four and um, we we'll refresh see it works okay so far we have this and it's extending too much the reason it's extending too much is that we've not created the remaining two so we have to create the remaining two now we have the working templates for one of the columns we can then um, multiply the column or duplicate the columns okay so we'll copy it below here we'll paste this and we'll paste this see in the next video where we multiply well when we modify the remaining two but if we check now we can see that we now have this three right thank you very much see you guys next video